listen to my story. This may be our last chance. Final Fantasy X, released in 2001 by Square Enix. This RPG not only marked the 10th installment of the beloved Final Fantasy series, it is the last one by its legendary creator. As Final Fantasy stands in a class of its own, it is a testament to the limitless potential of gaming as an art form. One of the most distinctive aspects of Final Fantasy X was the introduction of the Albed language. This constructed language added an immersive layer that to the game's world building, allowing players to dive Gilligan. deeper into the cultures and societies Quiet. of Spira. Almost the inclusion gentle. of the Albed language not only showcased the developer's commitment to creating a rich and vibrant universe, it also but gave you primers and a reason to explore every single corner of Spira to decipher problem? the language which led to secrets. They don't believe in Yevon, and in Luca they... The Sphere Grid, Final Fantasy X's innovative progression system, forever transformed character development in RPGs. Departing from the traditional linear leveling, the Sphere Grid in the original release is custom tailored for each character. Titus is built for speed, Yuna for healing, and Lulu for black magic, giving all the characters a unique way of having the classic job system that existed in older Final Fantasies. This system encouraged strategic decision making and experimentation, creating a dynamic gameplay experience that set Final Fantasy X apart from its predecessors, giving you the ability to change out characters in real time during battle to maximize your damage. Final Fantasy X pioneered a novel approach to character modeling by using separate models for cutscenes and gameplay. This dual model system ensured that players experienced the most realistic and visual appealing cutscenes while also allowing for smoother gameplay performance. This groundbreaking technique showcased the developers' dedication to delivering a cinematic experience without compromising the gameplay quality. This is also at a special time in the gaming industry where game engines did not exceed the technical capabilities of the hardware. It became a perfect balance for innovation, creativity, and visuals. Peaceful. Living with a smile on my face every day. You can once you beat Sin, right? <laughs> but then a new Sin will be born anyway. Well, then you can just beat it again. The voice acting in Final Fantasy X set a new standard for narrative-driven video games, featuring a stellar cast of voice actors who imbued the characters with depth and authenticity. The game's emotional resonance was greatly enhanced, from Titus's youthful exuberance to Yuna's serene wisdom. The performances of the voice cast allowed players to forge powerful connections with the characters immersing them further into the narrative. Two of these voice actors went on to be in some of the biggest franchises ever made. James Arnold Taylor is the iconic Ratchet and John DiMaggio is Marcus Phoenix. He actually voiced two characters in Final Fantasy X, Waka and Kamari. Nobuo Uematsu's musical genius reached new heights with the Final Fantasy X soundtrack. Revered as one of the best video game soundtracks ever composed, the music effortlessly swept players into the game's world, evoking a wide range of emotions. The iconic tunes, including the hauntingly beautiful Two Xanarkin and the exhilarating Otherworld, remained etched in players' memories as testaments to Uematsu's ability to create sonic masterpieces. Hearing this music, still takes me back to my Christmas break when I hooked up my PS2 in the living room and me and my mom played through Final Fantasy X together, just amazed by what we saw. The glass shattering sound effect accompanying the transition into battles in Final Fantasy X is a prime example of how small details can leave an unforgettable mark. This distinct audio cue immediately heightened player senses signifying a shift from exploration to action, evoking a rush of adrenaline. It's a testament to the power of audio design and enhancing player immersion and engagement. The inclusion of trigger abilities in combat 
added to the layer of tactical depth to Final Fantasy X's battles. These abilities allowed players to interrupt enemies or perform particular actions during turn-based combat, enabling diverse strategies and fostering a dynamic engagement with enemies. This created a level of action and change of pace for the turn-based RPGs. Final Fantasy X holds a bittersweet distinction as the last mainline installment of the series created by Hironobu Sakaguchi, the visionary behind the franchise's inception. With Final Fantasy X, Sakaguchi bid farewell to the series he created, leaving behind a legacy that would continue to inspire and captivate generations of gamers. From the optimistic Titus to the enigmatic Orin, the characters of Final Fantasy X remain in our memories, and it gave us one of the franchise's greatest villains, Maester Seymour. The exceptional character designs combined with their well-crafted backstories and development ensured that players would be engaged throughout this journey. These characters continue to be celebrated as some of the most iconic in the RPG genre. The Cloister of Trials, a series of puzzle-like challenges within sacred temples offered players a unique break from traditional gameplay while also serving as a narrative tool. These trials provided insights into the culture and the belief of Spira's inhabitants while challenging players' wits. Final Fantasy X is a monumental achievement that for ever altered the RPG landscape. Its captivating voice acting, unforgettable music, and numerous other elements showcase the dedication and creativity of the development team. As a swan song of its creator, Sakaguchi, Final Fantasy X encapsulated the essence of his visionary storytelling. With its legacy firmly established, Final Fantasy X continues to inspire both new and veteran gamers, reminding us of the boundless potential of video games as a form of artistic expression. There is still so much to explore in Final Fantasy X, so please stay tuned for part two. And would you kindly hit that like button and subscribe and leave a comment from your favorite memories of Final Fantasy X. This is it. This is the story.